YouTubers and content creators, it's the fourth quarter. It's the fourth quarter of 2018, that's crazy. So we gotta get ready for 2019. We gotta be prepared for success, right? Well, there's one analytic I wanna talk to you about today in downtown Denver, come on. Plenty, plenty of other YouTube channels out there that you could watch to learn about YouTube analytics, best practices on YouTube, best strategies for growing your YouTube channel. This is not one of those channels. I am simply communicating my life with you through a daily vlog. However, over the last 900 daily vlogs in a row, to over two and a half years, I've learned a ton about YouTube. And so that's why I'm here today to share my insights with you. And on that topic tonight, my Denver Broncos are playing the Kansas City Chiefs. And so in addition to talking to you today about analytics and the best analytic to pay attention to in 2019, I'm also gonna film my reaction to the Broncos pouncing the Kansas City Chiefs. All right, does that make sense, folks? I can come. Listen, folks, I get it. Everyone has bills to pay in this world. Cell phone, electric, internet, everyone has bills to pay. Well, on this daily vlog channel, the largest bill every month or every quarter is definitely purchasing external hard drive space. Every quarter I buy basically a four terabyte external hard drive because I never delete raw files, ever, ever, ever. And so, Part of this journey on YouTube is learning how to cover those overhead costs in the daily vlog or maybe your weekly, whatever you are, like there's costs behind this stuff. And therefore, because my channel was able to push through that 1,000 subscriber ceiling, now the ads are back, which basically covers the external hard drives that I have to buy to cover this filming for you guys. And so what I'm saying is like the YouTube ad revenue does help. It helps me buy the external hard drive every quarter and therefore the YouTube analytics is really important to me because I'm I want to make sure that we continue to trend in the right direction, which is probably why you're watching this video, this vlog is to learn about that analytic that I want to talk to you about. Let me just go set this tripod down. It's kind of heavy. Oh, let me just take this heavy backpack off. Got some camera gear in here. Okay, so there are plenty, oh, an overabundance of analytics in your back end of YouTube. You've probably explored around and clicked around to see what's back there. Frankly, it gets a little intense sometimes. So many different data points. A few that you may have seen already are, of course, your views, your unique views, your click-through rate, uh, of course, how many comments you're getting. But what about the most important? know what it is folks you know you already know what it is think about business what does YouTube want from you the creator they want you to inspire people to get onto YouTube and they want you to inspire people to stay on YouTube they don't want viewers to click away to Netflix to Hulu maybe to watch the news on CNN or Fox News or wherever they get their news they want you to inspire people to stay here that is their business model so the most important YouTube analytic in 2018 and moving forward into 2019 by far is watch time watch time that's right can you inspire and captivate your audience to keep them on your channel for as long as possible that is the big question We must never forget, YouTube creators, that YouTube is a business. And so the longer a patron stays in their store on YouTube, aka your YouTube channel, the happier YouTube is. And therefore, the much, much higher likelihood that they will promote your video to other people. But it means that your watch time must go up. It must continue to trend upward. If it's not trending upward, there's a, it's almost impossible for the YouTube algorithm to promote your videos and your channel to other people. Again, the only way that YouTube is gonna start promoting your vlogs, your how-to videos, whatever you're creating out there in the YouTube universe you got to make sure that people are engaged for the entire video if possible if possible on that note stick around I got a secret for you at the end of this video you 
you know, like this has been a hard lesson learned for me to have the daily vlog for 900 days in a row. It took me a long time to learn the lesson, but I finally learned it and I'm starting to create longer videos. And it's fun, it's hard, it's more work, but it's fun. And I believe, you know, gosh, six months ago now, I finally was able to break through that 1,000 subscriber ceiling, which I know a lot of you small creators are wrestling with and struggling with. If you have time, go click upper right-hand corner to that vlog. I talk about six tips on how to get, get through that 1,000 subscriber ceiling. But trust me, folks, the number one thing you can do right now is increase your watch time. Okay, this is a little sketchy. I don't know if I should be up here with a camera. Okay, no, we're going back down. I've got children. Okay, folks, what is in it for you? If you hit that subscribe button, turn on the notifications, basically next week I will do a vlog, a video for you guys about how to actually increase your watch time. I have ideas for you, tips, tricks. Hit that subscribe button. All right, I gotta get off of here. Folks, we're just cranking here. We're cranking here. We've been cranking, hitting that publish button for 900 days in a row. But we're trying to remain humble as well. There's a lot of work to be done, a lot of people to help. And that is the question of the day. What is your goal for your growth on your YouTube channel in 2019? Now I know that's three months away, but like I said at the beginning, it's not too early to start planning and strategizing for your success on YouTube moving forward. So that's the question of the day. Comment down below, I'd appreciate it. All right, folks, time for some tacos and some Broncos back at the house. I'm gone for eight hours at work and the neighbor's house popped the top. They, they are going for it. I'm telling you, don't move to Denver. Real estate is too high. Stay tuned for that secret tip, folks. I'm gonna give it to you in one second, but first I gotta watch my Broncos, my Broncos. Let's go Broncos! Nice, play action. Boom. Come on, come on. Come on, Freeman! Come on! Come on, come on, come on! Tacos and Broncos. Come on, two, three, start in the third corner! Vaughn Miller, come on, come on! Fourth and one. Get him, get him! This is, this is life. This is the blog. This is what I'm communicating to you through YouTube. <sighs> shaking off the loss. Shaking it off. Shaking off the loss. We're going to be okay, YouTube. All right. Watch time. Critical. Critical for your YouTube channel. But my secret tip. You ready for it? YouTube wants to know if your viewers are really, really engaged with your videos. What tells YouTube and the algorithm that your viewers are honed in into what they're watching? Rewind. Rewind. Remember VHS tapes you had to rewind before you turned them into the movie store? No. On YouTube, you just take your little finger and you move that little button back to the left. And basically, that tells the algorithm that your viewers really, really love what you're telling them or what you're showing them. So that is the secret tip for letting YouTube know and the algorithm know that, listen, this video is amazing. It has beautiful shots. I want to rewind to watch that shot again. Or that tip that was just shared, I want to rewind to see what he said. And so rewind is my secret tip for today. Remember, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell. More tips coming soon next week on how to actually increase your watch time. And don't forget, I've got plenty of videos on how to vlog better. Check them out, upper right hand corner. I love you guys. Thanks for being here. You rock. If you made it this far in the video, drop me a comment down below that says rewind. That, that, that tells me that you learned something today and that's all I'm about. I just want to teach you guys a few tips and tricks on how to improve your YouTube channel. Thanks for being here. I love you. Seek beauty, work hard, and love each other. See you tomorrow. Be back now. Come back. Come on. Come back tomorrow.